what I'm going to show you now is controlled articular rotation for the ankle. I have this stick with me because it gives me a little bit more stability. When you're doing this standing, you might need something uh, that's stationary. Here's the rule. You want to make sure that your knee is slightly bent enough so that when you point your foot down, it's not touching the floor. So you want to make sure that it's always hovering um, when you're doing this exercise. Um, the other thing is, is you want to, of course, irradiate about uh, 10 to 30 percent. So you want a 10 to 30 percent contraction through the rest of the body. So what I'm going to show you on this side, what I'm going to do is bend my knee slightly so that my, my foot will not touch the floor. First thing you want to do is you want to bring your foot straight up towards the ceiling so the back part of your foot should go towards the shin. From there you're going to scoop the bottom part of your foot inward and then once you reach your barrier, your end point, you're going to slowly point your toes downward. Once you reach your end point, then you're going to slowly rotate outward, scooping outward and then bringing that ankle back up so that back part of your foot is towards the shin as much as possible. Then you can repeat that process going in that circular motion, slowly point your foot all the way down, scoop outward, and then bring it all the way inward. Now as you start to do this exercise, you want to make sure that the shin bone is not moving. So when you're scooping inward, if you feel that shin is moving inward, uh, you don't want to do that. So you want to prevent the shin from moving. Every motion should be occurring at the ankle itself. And the same thing when you go outward, you don't want the shin to move outward. So you're going to rotate with just the foot going outward. Going through that motion with the shin not moving, foot is doing all the actions.